Bill shows the punch. So I'm going to come in, grab, break, break, strike, deliver with his elbow, come in, and then he throws a punch. And then from there, he throws another punch. Then from there, he throws a punch. It doesn't really matter. Boom. Bang. And he comes over here and hits me. Doesn't really matter which hand he's throwing. All right, so. Boom. All right, and he throws a punch. Boom. And <laughs> then he throws another punch. One, throws another punch. Bang. Throws another punch. Bang. There's another punch. Bang. Now Tiger breaks. One. And he grabs either the hand or the throat or jaw, whatever. Doesn't matter. Bang. And then break. There's a punch. Grab. Hmm. And you notice the tiger pulls him in. Tiger's a heavy cat. So instead of me going to the animal or prey, I pull them into me. Okay. Then he throws a punch. One, throws another punch, two, bang. Okay, then the same thing on the other side. So there are some repetition moves. Um, blah, blah, blah. Then he throws a punch. Terrible tiger claws the sand. Now what I'm doing is I'm breaking his arm, pulling him down, but I'm leaving the claws forward so I can gouge him in the eyes. <laughs> nice shot, I nailed it. Grab the throat, whatever, he throws another punch. Same thing here, boom. Okay, then from there he throws a punch. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's uh, Dragon spits out the pearls. He comes in to grab me. Tiger uh, stands. Okay, and then of course he can finish up from here. Mm -hmm. So those are basics. There's a lot more detail to it. But for right now, just to learn the form, those are kind of the basics that we want to use. Once again, as the punch is coming in, hmm, Tiger takes over as far as uh, strength. Tiger's a very strong animal. Uh, leaves his hands forwards, claws, whatever. Throws another punch. I want to be a hmm. Now this time, I was actually breaking his arm point. Bang, right there. Of course, call to the face. Thumb fits nicely into the eye. Lock the jaw. Another form of tiger would be uh, punch. When they come in to strike, they do come up in an angle to crush the throat. That's what big cats do. They can cut the wind off. But sometimes they break the neck. The tiger's very strong, so they would hit straight. Now, the idea behind that, if you take a look at his jawbone and how it runs to the base part of the skull and the spine. Instead of coming up at this fashion, I come in straight. And the idea is, is to draw, drive this jawline into the neck and sever the spinal cords. That's usually not a good thing. <laughs> so, anyway, these are very basic. There's nothing traditional about what we're doing. This is just uh, Lost Park Tai Chi Society having some fun, doing some different styles. So, that's Tiger style.